coming up. But first, parents are upset with a high school principal and a coach after their son reportedly suffered severe burns. Thank you for joining us at 6. I'm Brian Loftus. And I'm Denise Valdez. 8 News Now education reporter Joshua Pagaro investigates whether football players had to crawl on artificial turf in the heat as punishment. It was the first day of school on Monday and football practice during the afternoon apparently turned into one student suffering burns to their hands. Spring Valley High School parents who declined being identified sent me these three photos showing their son's heat-related injuries. They say their 16-year-old came home with their hands wrapped in bandages and they took him to urgent care. The parents say he and some members on the varsity football team were ordered to crawl on artificial turf. They say punishment for not wearing their knee pads properly. It happened around 3 p.m., which is considered peak afternoon heat. I showed the photos to some Valley High parents and grandparents. I'd be livid. You know, I'd want answers. I hope the kids are all right, but yeah, uh, whatever they did didn't, didn't demand for them to go through that and get hurt. I think it's ridiculous. Uh, kids are playing sports and not getting in trouble. Uh, I, like I said, it was my grandson, I'd really be mad. Medical experts we've interviewed say kids' outdoor sports activities should be scheduled outside of the hours of noon and 5 p.m. We see a large amount of pavement burns. They fall, they spend a short period of time on the ground, and they can develop third-degree burns on their extremities, arms, chest, back. Several parents I spoke to say the school should think twice before having kids practice outdoors during this heat. Reporting at Spring Valley High School, Joshua Piguero, 8 News Now. Now, the principal for Spring Valley High School sent an email to parents saying they're aware of what happened and canceled football practices today due to a lack of staffing. 